I don't think Blair like knows or cares. Whatever. I guess they're going to PS2 anyway. It's probably where they would have gone. Pretty sure that uh, no usually takes this matchup, right? Who? Or who usually wins between these two? Um, I, I don't know. I can't even remember how. how it works. I don't know. I don't know anymore. Um, oh, that was bad. I think it was, he missed the, the jump. I think he went to, wanted to uh, dare, which probably would have covered covered all of his options to be honest. Or he could have ledge canceled it, but I uh, missed the jump. All right. Yeah, no, I, I, I don't know. I feel like Link wins. I I think Link can just kind of like stuff uh, Luigi's, you know, approaches. Ooh. Yeah, I think, uh, not sure how Luigi will be able to deal with the boomerang a lot, especially during wave dash. Yeah, um, I mean, I, I think his best option is just kind of like, you know, wave dash, shield, you know, like wave dash had a shield to like block the boomerang. Um, I think matchup and experience with a, like, Beating tethers might also come to bite him in the ass. You know, the tether mechanics and... Oh, that was bad well, technical. No, Maybe Luigi's one of those magical characters that can't be chain grabbed by me. Is that kind of thing? Um, I think he might be able to nair out of it. Or maybe he's too floating. I don't know. I, You know, I really don't know enough about this matchup. Like, even back when they played... They, uh, you know, Camilo played very differently. They were both different characters, and I was a scrub, so I had no idea what was going on. I was just like, oh, Camilo can win sometimes, but so can Blair? Alright. But, uh... I feel like, you know, Link, Link has the tools to, like, wall, wall Luigi out, get some pretty early kills, maybe. Although, judging by how far that... What I'm seeing on this set uh, right now is... Blair's just the death. It's kind of big, you know, Link. Yeah, he's trying. He's definitely trying. Um, that was good on uh, Camilo's part, though. That, that was a good edge guard, rather. Okay. Uh, I think down throw is the way to go. Uh, up throw, Luigi's just too floating. But we'll see. I think they're both kind of like trying to relearn how this matchup works. Who would you think would take this matchup? I mean, like I said, um, you know, I think Link has the tools to wall Luigi out. Um, but I don't know. I guess we're going to find out. Um, because, you know, Luigi's fast, but, like, his movement, like, once you understand it, is pretty linear. Because, like, his, his aerial mobility is awful. So, like, that just shut, like, you know, Luigi doesn't really have, like, too many tools to actually approach. He's got, like, wave dash, forward tilt. And even that's, like, you know, unsafe on shield if you space it. It's yeah. pretty suspect. Yeah, if you space it right. He's got wave dash, forward tilt, wave dash, grab. What else does he have? That's about it. Um, I mean, what I do know... What I do notice about Blaya is especially with his like shield pressure, like the double area pressure on shield uh, yeah. against a lot of characters. He has like a really cool mix up where let's say you'll do one area on your shield, you'll wait to see what your reaction is and if he sees you pressing a button he just smashes A and you get in the air. Yeah. It's really interesting, I really like it. No, I agree. Um, and sometimes like he won't do double aerials. I noticed that as well yeah. when I was playing him. Uh, he'll do like one aerial and then just like land and like up tilt or jab. Uh, apparently I gotta go now. There you gotta uh, go. Guess I'm gonna get replaced by the best. All right. Um. Uh, What's up? Oh wait. Uh, you take Josh's set up. Game. Oh. Oh, Josh is getting stuck. The whip. Wait, did Josh? Oh. Okay, got it. All right. Peace out. Alright, so I'm being joined by Three, the best. Two, it was not the best one, today. Go. But that's alright. Sometimes it happens. Alright, so. Uh, okay, game Camilo, two. Yeah, it's game two. Camilo took game one, I believe. Yeah. I actually did not pay attention, I was distracted. But yeah, it looked like it. He yeah. sniped it super hard. Uh, alright. You know, I seem to remember 
Did they change Link's dash attack? Because I still remember him being able to combo. And I feel like they added like a couple of dead frames. Maybe I was just always having dead, bad DI. I have no idea, but you know what I do know? What? Link's really good. Link's pretty good. Link's not pretty good. Link's really Did you just see that? Link's super good. Camilla looks like Camilla makes him look a lot better than he is. But, you know, like I mean he can camp out his opponents, he's got good frames. Um, he's got super frames. Yeah, his, his out of shield options are, you know, okay. Up the out of shield? Up the out of shield's good, but like, you know, if you read it, it's punishable. Um, or, you know, like, it, it comes up fast, but like, you know, it, it's single hit, so like, if you shield it, you can just like do anything to him. Like, if, if you shield it, like, you can literally do anything you want to do. Uh, you know, you can just come from above. Uh, he's got Nair and Shield, which is also pretty good, but like, you know, it's not great. I guess he's got back air, but even that's like, I don't know, you know, Nair and Shield is not like that often. Yeah. Um, he doesn't have any like amazing approaches either. Not that he really needs them. Yeah, those are really amazing I know. approaches. He's got Met Boomerang. He's got, he's even got Hookshot. Yeah. People like these quick shots are like, oh, that's it. Alright, bait something. That was really good though by Camilo, recognizing that uh, Blair wanted to go for like the, the double aerial. And, uh. Oh, I guess he's got Up Smash out of Shield too. Up Smash out of Shield might actually be pretty good. Yeah, actually. Um. Let's see, like, DI it down to try to cross control. Yeah, and then you can only do that early percentages. Yeah. Uh. What I've noticed is like. Camilo's edge guarding uh, player like all wrong. He keeps on like going for uh, you know. Ooh. Wow, just, just tech! Just press L! Dude, it happens. You get hit by three back ears, you're gonna not know where he's gonna hit you. Yeah. No, yeah, I think I think he like missed the first tech and then like that close like and then he kept on like missing the timing, so it kept on like closing off the window. Oh that makes sense. Um Alright, stocks right now. Is that you? That was, that was pathetic. Just like crap. Just, just all right, whatever. Dude, we have to commentate on how, how you see the LB at a shield. Who's watching? We got no gorilla. I care. Right. Someone cares. That's true. I, I, I also care. Dude, these guys go back and listen to their matches and they care about commentary. That's our friends. That was very nice for I, I don't think Camilo ever watches the matches. Camilo doesn't watch the matches? I'm pretty yeah. sure he watches the matches. Nah. I, I've talked to him about it. He, uh... Ooh. He, like, barely can Whoa, Blaze actually brought this back. Oh, I thought he was just gonna up me right there. Yeah, I thought he was gonna be. I too. really thought he was gonna be like, spin to win. Alright, but see, look. He keeps on, like, covering, like, right above the ledge. like. But Blaze sweet spots every time. Every time. Like, I think he could just straight up, like, call him out, and just, like, come out, come down with a down air. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, he's right. dead. Wow. No right, contact. Good, good stuff to Blair. He, uh... He, uh, what's it called? He really brought that set back. Or brought that game back. We could see... I, you know, I don't want to call it an upset. But I guess it's a bit of an upset. Yeah, today's been Upset City. Yeah, it has been Upset City. Uh, Light beat Prof. We lost to Luca and Zig. Zig beat Prof. Uh, who else did Zig beat? I feel like Zig, Zig beat uh, some other people. I can't believe I lost to Luca. Yeah, I can't believe I lost. Dude, I know. I lost to Kenny. I lost to Frio. What the fuck is it? I'm sorry. What is today? No, you can say what the fuck. I don't think we're esports. I think we're pretty esports. Are we? I, I swear I've heard people curse on the stream. They probably do. But, I mean, like, we're PM, yo. I think the beauty of like PM, like never getting like proper sponsorships, is that we never have to be esports. Yeah, but we have a 13 year old like top player, Mr. LZ. Yeah. Yo, I was nice. cursing like a fucking sailor when I was 13. Well, you know what? You shouldn't have. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Oh shit, look at that way. Oh, this is actually really good. Alright, let's do some time too. Yeah. Alright, good day. I'm not even commentating what's happening. Uh, yeah, honestly, like, I'm kind of too tired to, like, really. I, I feel like I'm, like, losing my, you know. I'm in pools of salt right now. Yeah, I know. I am. I understand. It's okay. No, it's not even, like, just today. Fucking nice pool. Oh, that's it. There we go. Yep. 
dude, Luigi's Dare is so, like, meaty. It is very meaty. All of Luigi's Aerial is actually very meaty, yeah. Well, I mean, alright, that's what I was saying. Because Luigi just kind of, like, like, he's kind of just, like, a really, like, mobile peach, in a sense, you know? Um, yeah. Oh, that Nair! Oh, oh the misfire! But he eats the up B and gets sent off stage. Oh, oh that was so free! Alright, he keeps on going for the dare read. Honestly, what I would do there... Alright, bro, I lost to you. I'm fine. Uh, I didn't have matchup experience. That was good. Yeah, it was a good set. Okay, I I'm not sure... I'm not 100% sure if this would work, but he keeps on going for the down air into, like, the dare read. I think what he can do instead is just double jump onto the platform and then up B. Right? That covers... Alright, so... Like, at high percentages, right? Like, if he's gonna grab Luigi and, like, right, right beneath the platform... And Leo will, every time, he will go towards the platform and tech. And Camilo will go for a dare read. We'll try to read the tech and then, like, lose. Right? And he won't get the tech. I think he could just wave land onto the platform and then just up beat, right? Very true. Yeah. Yeah. He might not be that. fast enough, actually. I, I mean, like, Link's double jump is like, I don't know. Maybe it's not. I feel like it is, though. Or, I mean, he could even just fair, though. Like, he can cover all the options. Or up air. I think up air would be fine, too. He just keeps going for the dare read. It's, you know, it's, it's not working for him. Alright, you know what it is? I think Camilo feels like dare is very safe on the shield, like anything Luigi does. Or Luigi's shield is not the most stable. So if he gets a dare, not only does he get Pogo Stick away, he probably pushes Luigi very far away. So he probably feels safer just a dare. Ah, dude. That was a bad roll. I guess he was scared of uh, Luigi's up to stage spiking him, but like, in that in that situation, I don't think I would have rolled. Yeah, uh, I, like, rolling I literally played like what today, covered in oh, some other night. scene thing. Uh, so, play it. Whoa, the hang! I actually did not expect him to make that. Oh, we have Yeah, let's go. No, it beats double aerial, which I think is pretty big. It's pretty big in this matchup because, like, you know, Luigi. Because he doesn't have like good aerial mobility, he can't really space his aerials properly. Like it's really hard to space him right. So he kind of like relies on double aerials to like keep people like stuck in their shields. Like he doesn't care. Like right there. Yeah. Like Link does not care about uh, double aerials. And actually, that makes me think. Maybe a Squirtle like maybe a Squirtle like up smash out of shield before you can get into a second aerial. You know that sounds like something very possible. Yeah, and if that's the case, but like, you're both very slighty. So like, if you get hit on shield, then you probably get. Uh, it depends on what he hits you with. He he was hitting me with double aerials earlier today, um, when we played in, in tournament, and uh, that, that should have been up here. Like he's getting really greedy with these dares, but like honestly, like Luigi's floaty enough that up air I think will kill like a reasonably early percent. See, that was a, that was a good attempt with up air. Um. Yeah, I think Blaze is starting to figure him out. Uh, yeah, that was a great game. Yeah. But yeah, it looks like for the first time in a long time, Camilo has some competition in South Florida. Thank God. I actually kind of want Blaze to win, just so like Camilo has to like, learn and adapt. I think that's his biggest problem as a player. Like. He, he doesn't adapt. Like, he, he's got his flowchart, but then if someone, like, figures him out, like, he doesn't know how to, like, like, figure out how to, like, beat the new strategy. Right? Because, like, no one down here makes him do it. Like, he can just kind of, like, rely on, like, being a good player and, like, no one will really, like, beat him. I mean, you gotta give him where we're playing, dude. He probably does that. You can't say he doesn't. I mean, obviously he does. Like, you know, like, he, he wouldn't he wouldn't be as good of a player as he is if he didn't adapt. But I think, like, comparatively speaking, like, he adapts less than other players. Alright, that was a bad roll. He could have just waited. That was a matchup experience. See, look at these up airs. Like, I think up airs, like, the matchup, or is the... Wow, I love those deep nairs. Dude, it's so crazy. Alright. You know, as I say that, as I talked about Camilo not adapting, I think he's showing a lot of serious adaptation in this set. Uh, never mind, let me let me just let, that's like commentator's curse, like for sure. Like he's making the adjustment to edge guard Luigi. Um, whereas before he was just like Yeah, he's trying to he's trying to do it right now. 
You know, I... Alright, I don't know why I went for the dare when the up airs were like clearly working. <coughs> yep. Alright, no force dog. You can see Camilo like a little bit upset. I didn't see it, but I'm sure he did like his little Ooh, handshake. He read that jump and caught it with the dub. <coughs> oh, he wanted, he wanted the JV, but dropped it with, a, with that up uh, He's in a very Ooh. solid position. Right now, Camilo just has to play. Oh, yeah. He just has to not be bad. He can literally up be out of shield five times. Yeah. So, probably win this. Oh, near. Oh, but Luis. Alright, and Blea adapting to that and uh, avoiding it. I'm not really sure how, because it always happens in like, the microscope. But uh, manages to avoid the deep near, probably by going in close to the stage. He's going hard. That's right. it. There. Good yeah. stuff, no Camilo. Losing losers finals.